He is exalted above happening opponents. Adad or equals and that. So Allah Azza Jal has no one to oppose him. No one can stand in front of him. What he wills happen. What he does not will does not happen. And there is none equal to or like him. As Allah Azza Jal says, said, there is none like unto him. So there is no opponent or no equal to Allah Azza Jal. That's why in our speeches, we make sure that we do not make mistakes. For example, when we say, after Allah's permission and your permission, I want to do so and so. Is this a good statement? Why? We make him, the person, as equal. So we say, after Allah's permission, then your permission. So because Allah's permission is first, and the people's permission is not equal to Allah's permission. So we always need to make sure that when we speak, we do not put the creation at the same level or equal to Allah Azza wa Opponents, nowadays people are starting worshipping shaitan. And they are considering him as an opponent to Allah Azza wa And the reason why they worship shaitan is they say that he's the only one who rejected the order of Allah Azza wa Jal and said, I don't want to prostrate to Allah. So he rejected the order of Allah. So Allah did not do to him anything, meaning that he's stronger from Allah Azza wa He's a dud, so which is unacceptable. And that's why they started worshipping devil, because they thought that he was able to oppose Allah's order.